welcome to X-Files Season 2. Without further ado, let's get started with the first episode, Little Green Men. This episode picks up right where Erlenmeyer Flask ended, with the X-Files gone and Scully and Mulder separated. Scully's put doing some medical shit while Mulder has to work on insurance fraud. He's fucking miserable. They only ever talk to each other in secret and fear that people are still watching them. They have one of their secret meetings and Mulder tells her that he is starting to not believe. She tells him how could he not after all he's seen and that's basically their conversation. Mulder then gets called to see one of his senator friends who tells him about some information down in a facility in Puerto Rico. Some proof of extraterrestrials. So Mulder packs his bags and goes to see it. When he gets there he finds some guy in the facility. They become friends and him and Mulder stay there looking for any proof of extraterrestrial life. Eventually the other guy gets spooked by some noise and runs out into a rainstorm dies. Then Mulder gets a visit from aliens. Scully finds out where he is and goes down to rescue his ass before the military kills him. The government's watching her though, and as soon as she gets there, the military shows up and they have to get their asses out of there fast. Mulder grabs a tape with some evidence on it before he skedaddles, and they escape by driving like fucking lunatics away from the soldiers. When he gets back to DC, he gets his ass chewed out by Skinner, but in the end, he just gets a slap on the wrist. And that's the end of the episode. Now I will say, this is a pretty decent episode, but I do have one problem with it. I think they should have done something better with the setup they had from Erlenmeyer Flask, but eh, that's just me. Anyways, see you guys tomorrow.